And so, we've almost reached the halfway point of the Year of the Dragon. What have we experienced so far? Let's take a deep dive to our two entertainment options and see if any title is possible for a physical release in today's episode of Destination Nostalgia. Last month, I had discovered the IF movie in Dolby Cinema and turned out to be heartwarming enough to add to my physical DVD collection in the near future. There is one more franchise in movie slash TV show category that I expected more to be a complete series DVD copy. That is, Back at the Barnyard. I have checked many reliable resources but there is no evidence for the official DVD release yet. The last complete series DVD release was discovered in Walmart called Danny Phantom. Normally I am not interested in this franchise as much as the other Nicktoons I know. However, if one can do it, so could Back at the Barnyard as well, whether to be released by Shout Factory or Paramount later on. My video game collection continues, though only with one console, the PS5, with four slots remaining. Last time, in a speculative Dolby console game list video, I had discussed a few potential titles possible for a physical PS5 release, one of which is Lush Royal Photography Sim, a photography simulation game where you take various slash realistic photos of landscape slash artifacts in locations galore. This game is developed by Matt Newell, based in Perth, Australia, using Unreal Engine 5. Now, it would be great to add to my physical collection, until I stumbled upon Microids, which may have a better title based upon my opinions. More details when we come back. TMP Cyberlink Studios, possibilities are endless. With inspiration from up to 50 different companies slash franchises, we make speculations of intriguing slash family friendly dreams, hopefully to come to reality in the near future. Please help support our channel by giving a like, subscribe, Ring the bell icon and check out our community tab to experience destination nostalgia like never before. Microids intrigues me the most with the Smurfs franchise. The one title that I'm looking forward to within their catalog is the Smurfs Dreams, a more familiar 3D platforming game which reminds me of Super Mario 3D World. As for this, it is developed by Alsla Studio, based in Lyon, France. Judging their last main title, Marsubalami Hoop Adventure, this may potentially be running in its recurring Unity engine, except with updates. In addition, it has a more concrete release date in 2024, possibly around October, whereas Lushville Photography Sim does not reveal yet. Though, these two game titles all come down to my personal preference. For the next title, I expected more with Outright Games and 3D Clouds to make another 3D open world based game, like Paw Patrol World. Last time I reviewed this, I have wished for more improvements, including new locations to explore slash playable characters, swimming underwater for hidden collectibles, pop mouth movements while talking in game cutscenes, additional dialogue while exploring in addition to interacting with people and or objects, and various grunting sound effects when jumping in the next title or a similar franchise that I find familiar with. There are no other news to report even for Spiral 4, which it may be released in late 2025. However, if there are any other updates I have missed, 
as this video is being premiered, I will let you know in the description. Of course, if you have any other questions or updates, please let us know in the comments section below. Thank you, Nostalgia Seekers, for your attention and watching this video. We'll see you next time, as we unveil the hidden wonders of Destination Nostalgia.